So I am back with more news of Cyberpunk DLC. This time spoke about by the Cyberpunk League Quest designer, where he actually states or indicates DLC could be coming as early as this month. Today we get into all the details. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video, hitting that like button really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So over the past two weeks or so, Cyberpunk has heated up a little with reports of leaked DLCs and expansions, DLC missions already in the game to play and much much more. I mean it isn't anything too serious and obviously we should take it uh, or take all these leaks and data mind info with a pinch of salt, but when someone who works directly on the game starts talking about it and insinuating DLCs coming very soon indeed, I feel this is when it gets a little more serious and we should probably take a little more interest. So this is what went down. A couple of days back, Cyberpunk's lead quest designer, Paul Sasko, as you may know, does sometimes stream the world of Cyberpunk and Night City, which if I'm honest is actually quite a decent watch. But on one of his past few streams, he spoke about DLC, which you can see on screen now. Uh, you, yeah, I'm feeling it, it feels like I'm, I'm just interrogating another guy from Red, so maybe I should ask him about the DLC, right? Hellman. Where am I? What is this place? This is not important. You need to tell me about the DLC. Like, if you blink, the DLC is being released this month. He didn't blink, guys. Oh, he blinked. He blinked. He blinked. What? Having said that, I think that the next stream, actually, I will have a really interesting surprise for you. And I hope that it's really gonna happen uh, because preparing some things takes time. Um, but uh, I'm, I'm working on something um, and I, I hope that the next stream is going to be even uh, more interesting. So what, I would say so what I take from this, I feel when he asked Hellman about the DLC and asking him to blink if the DLC is coming this month, I don't think he expected him to actually blink straight away as we really only have a few days left of this month so I feel it's more or less impossible right now to get DLC out especially for a game well of this size and although it hasn't got many people playing it the people that follow it is absolutely massive I probably think CD Projekt Red would want to advertise this on a much broader scale and to do so with only a few days left of this month I feel would be more or less impossible. Next month though, I feel we might actually see something. As he goes on to state that within his next stream, he has something they are working on, something they are preparing, which indicates work in progress. This to me does confirm something new is coming for Cyberpunk. So within his next stream, he may showcase what this is, where it may be released next month. While it is though, we do not know yet. Could be a new mission, new quest line, new weapons, clothes, armor, etc, etc. We just do not know. Because DLC means downloadable content. It could be something small or something massive. So yes guys, straight from the horse's mouth, I feel over the next week or so, we will hear of something new. I just feel Cyberpunk now is past that stage where game changing DLC will bring everybody back. It does however and is right now at a stage where it kinda needs reviving to slowly entice players back. If they can do this with monthly DLC add-ons, I feel it could indeed slowly build back up its community. I mean it was confirmed before release that this game will get more DLCs than The Witcher 3, so what's that? 15, 16 plus? We have seen data mine files confirming 15 or 16 DLCs downloadable content add-ons. We've also seen data mined info on two expansions. So one DLC a month isn't over expecting and in my opinion it's something that is needed if this game stands a chance. I mean they could even do it every two weeks. If the DLCs are believed to be just add-ons like armor sets and weapon sets, new cars and things like this, I don't feel it'd be too hard to incorporate. Considering what the modding community has been doing for this game, over the past what six months, I feel these mini incorporations 
won't be too hard to do. But yeah, over the next few weeks, it's going to be interesting. And if anything else new arrives, I will have you covered right here on my channel as per usual. But yes, guys, tell me your thoughts on this down below. If you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.